Well, the cold day didn't stop hundreds of volunteers from serving the local homeless community. Blessings Under the Bridge held their big winter event today where people in need could load up on winter clothes, blankets and hot meals. Plus, United Healthcare provided checkups to many who haven't seen doctors in years. KXLY 4's Katie Curry working for you tonight with the importance of this event. This is the ninth year of Blessings Under the Bridge big winter event. And unfortunately, the need only continues to grow. As snow fell and temperatures barely climbed above freezing, many in need came to get help. Anyone in need, everyone's welcome. There's no stipulations whatsoever. Everybody's here to just receive and we're here to give. Blessings Under the Bridge estimates they've served 10,000 people in the nine years the event's been held. Every year, it continues to grow a new group of people to help. This year, it's a lot of families. It's not, it's just, not the just the homeless. Jessica and Mike Kovac know how great the need for support is in Spokane year round. They spend every Wednesday night under the bridge, not only feeding, but caring for those in need. We've seen a lot of purple and black fingertips. Um, we've taken people to the hospital where it's like that, you know, fragile of, like, if they're, yeah, they're yeah. going to lose their, yeah. their fingers. With cold temperatures and more snow in the forecast, the city says they are working to provide shelter for as many as they can. The warming shelters are, are being utilized this year uh, at, at high numbers. They're, you know, it's not uncommon to have 90 people at a warming shelter in addition to the uh, people who'd be staying in the emergency shelters across Spokane. But it will take the community to end homelessness. There's no silver bullet to end homelessness, and we need a lot of people to be helping out with that. If you're looking for ways to get more involved with the community, we've attached a link on our website at kxly.com. Reporting in Spokane, Katie Curry, KXLY 4 News. All right, doing some good things out there. Thanks, Katie.